Hello friends, my name is Tushar and today we're going to talk about the question string interleaving problem. So the question is, given three strings, you have to tell if third string is an interleaving of first and second string or not. By interleaving, I mean that if third string should be entirely made up of characters in first and second string, and the order in which characters appear in first and second string should be preserved. For example, if I have three strings, first string is AAB and second is AXY, so you have to tell, you have to return true if this is entirely made up of this and the order in which they appear here should also, they, they should appear here. So let's see here, AAXABY is entirely made up of characters in this two and the order in which AAB appears here. So AAB and AXY, AXY is same, so this should return true. This is another string ABAAXY and this should return false because Although it is made up of characters here, the order is not preserved. So how do we solve this question? Yes, we'll use dynamic programming to solve this question. So here I have a two-dimensional matrix. My first matrix, uh, my first, uh, here the row column is made up of AAB and rows are AXY. And I have my third string, A, A, X, A, B, Y. All right. So 0 and 0 is true. So let's try to fill up the 0th uh, column. So when I'm looking at A, I'm comparing this A with this A. If this both of them are same, I'm saying is it is true if the guy, if the value on the left of me is true. So since this is same and this is true, so this is true. All right. If when I'm looking at this A, I'm comparing second character with this. So this is same as this, and the value on the left of me is also true, so this is true. X. Since X is different from B, this is directly false. All right. Let's fill up the first column, zeroth column. So here A is same as A. When this is same, I'm saying is, the value on top of me is true or not. So this is true, so this also becomes true. Now I'm comparing A with X, second character here and second character here. So this is not same, so this is false. Now I'm comparing Y with X, so they're different, so this is false. So I filled up my first row, of zero row and zero to column, so I'll now I'll fill up rest of my matrix. So when I'm trying to fill up this cell, I have two characters here. So basically I'm going to compare it with the second character. I'm going to come see if this is same as either of this. So it is actually same as both of this. So in this case, what I'll check is if this A, if since this A is same as this A, I'm checking is if is the guy on top of me true or not. So it is true, so this is also true. So now I move this by one and we move here. Is, is this X same as either this A or this A? It is not, so this is uh, false. Is this A same as this B or this A? This A is same as this A. So is the guy on top of me true? No, this is not, so this is also false. So basically, if I have a string A, A, B and A and first four characters to consider here, are these first four characters interleaving of A, A, B and A? They are not, which is why this is false. All right. Let's introduce X. So now I have X, so this is, and I'm considering this point. So one character from here and two characters from here. So here I'm looking at the third character. Is this X same as this? It is. So which means that I will look at the top guy on the top of me, which is true, so this is also true. Basically I'm saying is if I had one character here and two characters here, A, A and A, X. I'm saying A, A, X is inter interleaving of A, A, A. A, A, X, which is why this is true. I'm going to consider the fourth A, A and A, X. So I'm going to look here. Is this A either same as this or this? It is same as this. So if since it is same as this, I'm going to see is, if the character on left, if the value on left of me is true or not. This is true. So what this also, this is also true. Since this A and this A are same, all I'm checking is, is this A and this A, X same as are interleaving of this or not. Since this is an interleaving of this, so adding one more A makes it as a, still keeps the interleaving in place, So, which is why this is true. Let's 
try this one. So is this B same as this or this? It is same as this. So I'm checking is the guy on left of me true or not? This is true. So which is why this is true. Again, this, this B and this B, if we remove them, we are left with AA, AX. And that is an inter and this AA, AX is an interleaving of AA, AX. So this is true. And this B and this B adds to the interleaving. So which is why this is also true. But let's fill up the last, uh, last row. So I'm looking at the fourth character. So I'm looking here. Is this A same as Y or A? It is same as A. So it means that is the guy on the left of me true? No. So this is false. Let's try this one. Is B same as A or Y? No. So this is false. Let's look at Y. Is this Y same as either this or this? It's same as this. So I'm saying is, is the guy on top of me true? It is true. So this is also true. So again, since this is same as this, I'm checking is it does AX and AAB make up the, they interleave to form the first uh, five characters of this string? Yes, which is why this was true. And since this Y is same as this Y, it will continue to form the interleaving, which is why this is true. So finally, this is our answer. Yes, AAB and AXY will interleave to form AAXABY. Let me quickly write the formula for this one. If str3, which is our this string, i plus j equal to equal to str1i, then I'll say t of i j is equal to, if it is, then I'm looking at the guy at the top, so t of i minus 1 j. If str3 i plus j is equal to equal to str2 j then I'm looking at the value on the left so ti j minus 1 for everything else t of i j is equal to false if you want the full solution for this problem, go to my GitHub link, github.com, Mission Peace Interview Wiki. If you want to check out similar questions, go to my YouTube channel, youtube.com, user to 2525. Thanks for watching this video.